96 such angulo 96 angulum one angula is average diameter of your finger middle finger 1.6 cm approximately into 96 that is your average height or ga hasta ka 1 ka 2 ga 3 ga 4 ga hasta from this tip to this tip into 4 that is your average height like that nara shi yojana sha 80 shi 8000 so 8000 the average height of the man is one yojana is equal to 12.11 km so the diameter of earth is 1050 yojana means 1050 into 12.11 km you calculate it you can see that it is 3.1 km less than the modern value so the book written during 499 ad march 21st on sunday mid noon that book was completed aryya batiya book was completed that is 1503 years ago and in that book aryya batiya has clearly mentioned the diameter of earth and if you do not know as a student the aryya batiya number system you cannot claim to discovery channel national geography channel or scandinavian university or london university you cannot say that the diameter of the earth is known to indians about 1500 years ago you cannot say that because this value you know this number you don't know so aryya batiya number system you should learn then you can put forth not your galileo not your copernicus not your silver nicus has discovered this it is we have discovered <laughs> ಸೊ for one breath we take approximately 4 second in 4 second earth rotates at one angular minute prane naiti kala one kala means one angular minute buhu earth bramayati rotates so rotation of earth indians have discovered very clearly declination of earth bha ಅಪಕ್ರಮೋಗ್ರಹಾಂಶ ಸಪೋಸ್ ಯು ಡೂ ನಾಟ್ ನೋ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಭಾ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅಪಕ್ರಮ ಕಾ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಮಾ ಈಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ಮಾ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಭಾ ಬಾ ನೋ ಭಾ ಈಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಭಾರತ ಬಾ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಬಿರಿಯಾನಿ ನೋ ಬಿರಿಯಾನಿ ಬಾ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಭಾರತ ಭಾ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ಭಾರತ ದಟ್ ಭಾ ಅಪಕ್ರಮ ಡಿಕ್ಲಿನೇಷನ್ ಗ್ರಹ ಅಂಶ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಸೊ ಎರ್ಸ್ ಡಿಕ್ಲಿನೇಷನ್ ಇಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಮಾಡರ್ನ್ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ತ್ರೀ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಾಫ್ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಸೊ ಅವರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕವರ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ದಿ ಎರ್ಲಿ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಸೆಂಚುರಿ ಸಿ ಗೋ ಅಂಡ್ ಎರ್ತ್ ರೊಟೇಟ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ಟು ಈಸ್ಟ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಬಟ್ ಆರ್ ಟೆಲ್ಸ್ ಅನುಲೋಮ ಗತಿರ್ನೌಸ್ತಃ ಪಶ್ಯತಿ ಅಚಲಂ ವಿಲೋಮಗಂ ಯದ್ದತ್ ಅನುಲೋಮ ಯು ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ನೌ ಹೂ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೋಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ವರ್ಡ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ಬೋಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ವರ್ಡ್ ಪಶ್ಯತಿ ಯು ಆರ್ ಸೀಯಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಅಚಲಂ ಆಲ್ ದ ಮೆಟೀರಿಯಲ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಂಟ್ ಆನ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ರಿವರ್ ಅಚಲಂ ವಿಲೋಮಗಂ they are going backwards when the boat goes forward you see the either side the materials are going or the trees are going backward just like that anuloma gatihi nauhu staha staha standing pashyati achalam vilomagam yaddat achalani bhani taddat 
all the celestial bodies which are achala, sama paschimagani lengaya. From the equator, you see that the celestial bodies are going towards west because earth is moving towards east. You are going towards eastern direction. So, systematically, Aryabhata has mentioned it. He has discovered the method for determining the square root of any large number. He is the first person who has discovered the, num the method for determining cube root. Aryabhata is the first person who wrote sin theta and cos theta in the applied field. And now, a series of other books are there as students. If you are going to Bahabhaskariya, written during 628 AD, Leghubhaskariya, written during 629 AD, or Brahmaspuda Siddhanda, written during 528 AD, Vadeshwara Siddhanda, 748 AD, or Lella Charya Sushyadhi Vrithnidandra, written during 825 AD, or so many books are there, all are available with English translation. And if you have to learn anything from that astronomy or mathematics, you should learn Bhuta Sangya, second number system in India, Bhuta Sangya. Learning Bhuta Sangya, you will take maximum five minutes, not more than that. But unless you know Bhuta Sangya, you have heard Bhuta Pradha, it is not connected with that. Bhuta Sangya is Pancha Bhuta Sangya. So, Bhuta Sangya, understanding it is very easy, just like storytelling. Nayanam, Akshi, Netram, number two. For writing two, you say Nayanam or its synonym. For writing two, you can use Srotram, here, Karnam, it is also two. For writing number one, Earth, Bhumi, Prithvi, Dhara, Dharitri, Choni. Indu, Chandra, Shashi, Shidambu, Ratrinjara. All the names are for number one, for writing one. And for writing three, you can write Rama. Why Rama? Rasurama, Balarama, Sri Rama. So Rama means three. Agni means three. Garhabatya Agni. Similarly, Rahaspada Agni, Raja Bhatya Agni. Three Agnis are there. So Agni, Anala, Vanni, Havikaraga, all these number three. Guna means three. When I say the example, it will become very clear. Sattva Guna, Rajo Guna, Tamo Guna. So three Gunas are there. In Tamil Nadu, two are there. In Kerala, only one last one. So you can see three Gunas are there. So guna means three. So wherever we say guna, it denotes three. Veda means four. Veda means four. You know what is the reason? Vanam, forest means four. Samudra means four. And when we write Grigari series, Vyasa, Vanasangunita, Pradagaptam, Tri Adi, Ayukvimulakanaihi, Vyase, Trinikne, Kramasaha, if you do not know the meaning of vanam, vyasat, vanasangunita, you are multiplying the diameter with the forest. What is the meaning? You are multiplying the diameter with the forest. Who can multiply the diameter with the forest? So vyasat, vanasangunita, vanam means four. So you are multiplying the diameter with four. Tari Panja Sattva Dhyayu Gahradhani that I will tell later. So, one, earth, bhoomi, something like that. Two, Nayanam Srotra, synonym. Guna, Rama, Vanni, etc. For three, Veda, Samudra, and Vanam, Kananam, etc. For four, Panja Sharam, Panja Prana, Panja Bhuta. So, Bhuta means five, Prana means five, Sharam means five. Wherever you have to write five, use the Sanskrit word. Shad Ritu. Ritus are six. Shad Ritu. Shad Rasa. Rasa and Ritu, six. Sap 
ಸಪ್ತ ಋಷಿ ಋಷಿ ಮುನಿ ಸವನ್ ಸಪ್ತ ಸ್ವ 